Hi guys, um, welcome back again and um, coming up with another video. Um, I picked up this um, Mac um, keyboard Gen 1 um, Bluetooth keyboard um, in the non-working condition. Um, the reason being is it doesn't connect to the um, uh, system, um, iMac system or there is no, there should be a, when you press the button there should be a um, a light coming up here which is you know which indicates um, the battery is good and the keyboard is working but for some reason it is not working um, uh, so what I did is um, I gone through um, going through web to find out a solution um, there is nothing much um, available in the sense that uh, they ask you to um, most of the um, videos are mostly stuck batteries in, in, in the back and then you know um, how to remove it but there is no information really um, about um, how to fix this so um, what I did is <clears throat> normally the keyboard comes with this so like um, there would be a gray um, cover here and then um, there is one here which is um, um, Bluetooth connectivity, so power and Bluetooth connectivity, and then the other side would be the where you put in the batteries in. Um, normally, just to inform you, the battery goes in positive and this way. Hope you can see it this way in um, two batteries, um, AA batteries. So, what I did is <clears throat> it didn't work, there is no light coming up even though um, the batteries are new batteries um, when i try to press in the power it doesn't there is no light and it doesn't connect to um, bluetooth um, what i did is i opened up the back gray cover which is this um, it's a little bit difficult because um, it is plugged in like this um, so there is not much gap to wiggle room to um, open the the gray cover so what i um, got is i got this slim um, um, opener and then i wedged in between hope you can see it uh, in the corner here in this gap and to open up once you wedge in and then you can just it's a clip just go go through the entire row the click to click with uh, you know pops up and then you can open the cover like this so once you open the cover um, what I did is I just um, turn around so that you can see and this is the power button this side is the power button once you open this there is a cable here so you need to open the cable you just hope you can see it just um, Pull down the clip. There is a clip in here. Um, I don't know whether you can see it or not. This clip. Um, so that's the clip. Um, so what you need to do is, hope you can see it. I'm just holding the phone. I'm trying to do this. You need to open the clip. I'll show you how to. Hope I don't drop it. So if you can go in here, there's a clip. You, know, you need to just pull up and then same way you need to pull on the other side too once you pull uh, pull up the clip don't pull too hard the clip will break so just pull a little bit so it will open up like this you can see it. that's that's the gap once you have that you just put the um, you know opener and you need to open this side too can see that it came up and you just put the um, 
let me grab a um, screwdriver, thin screwdriver. Something like this. So you just wedge in, in, in between here, for example. Hope you can see. Wedge in between here, just go through all the way in, and then just slowly pull the um, cover, um, the cable off. So when, once your cable comes off, then you know you just fold it down and then what you do is next thing is you just push the push the um, um, entire there is a plastic with the um, circuit board on it so you just push it in push this way push this way so this this power button just comes off um, the whole socket will come off so once you remove the socket and then just clean it make sure that there is no dust or anything um, and then what i notice is the spring uh, over the period of time it goes into the contact the the battery positive contact doesn't uh, fit in properly and, and that's uh, that's uh, one of the reason why it is not powering on because there is no contact happening and on the battery side, even though you plug, you know, even though you screw it up, that um, um, screw the uh, the other side in. Hope you can see it. This side in, and this side goes in here. Uh, it's like a screw. Just open it up. The contact doesn't go, you know, doesn't touch. So that's the reason you don't see the lights coming up. So once I cleaned up, and I cleaned this side too, on the battery side. Um, cleaned up everything and then I clean the contact and clean the this side the the screw side also um, and I what I did is I just this the since the over the period of time this uh, spring goes in you know um, it doesn't expand much so it doesn't provide the, the proper contact what I did is I extended the you know I just extended the con and spring a little bit further so that the contact will happen and, and that's what I did so I ex um, little bit extended the spring and then cleaned up everything and then put the new battery in and screw it up and now I can you know um, put them put the thing back in here And the positive side positive side goes in so People normally when they feel that you know it's not working then they just uh, throw away and just re you know it's just you know landfill I'm trying to fix and reuse it and uh, if it works it works otherwise at least you give give a try um, it's uh, satisfying so at the end of the day you're trying to um, you know save money and also save uh, environment so that's pretty much it so you know, just uh, you just need uh, something like this to hope you can see it yeah oh, you can, it's a small battery uh, you can use the coin I'm just
So let's go to bed. And then let's uh, tie it. So go to the system. System. Pick inside. Um. Two turn. Yes. It's lighting up, you can see the light, and you can see the system, I can see the cable, 3, 3, 2, that's it, so I can see the light cable connected, so uh, let's see it works. Right, so yeah, there you go, guys. So you can fix um, at least give it a try and try to fix it, and hope you save uh, money and then uh, save the environment. Thanks for watching. I'll come up with another video. Thanks, bye.